you want to know how to create Google Ads callout extensions, it's actually pretty straightforward. I'll kind of walk you through the process here as well as um, some additional information about how to understand this data because that's also important. But when you're in Google Ads and you've got a, a campaign selected, you can go over to Ads and Assets and then instead of clicking Ads, if you click on Assets, that's essentially going to be your extensions. It used to be called extensions, but now there's, I guess, multiple things in here. So once you're in assets, you can actually toggle on which ones you want to focus on. So you can click call out and you'll be able to see if you have any existing currently. You can see we've got five of them already set up here. And if you don't have any set up, then all you need to do is click this blue plus button here. And when you do that, it's going to open up this window. It looks just like this, where you can then start adding some text in for your callout extensions. So let's go over a couple of things here. First of all, callout extensions can be added to a campaign or an ad group. Actually, it can be added to an entire account as well. I wouldn't necessarily recommend that, but usually you'll use it at a campaign or ad group level. Because we, are, we have a campaign selected, we're going to use the campaign level and then we'll want to create new if you have existing ones you can access those here but we'll just click create new and then from here we can actually add the call out extension text there's going to be four here initially we can actually add more um, and I typically try to add as many as I possibly can and essentially a call out extension is sort of like something that you want to call out about your business that makes it unique and separates you from the crowd. So you can see we have some here and it's actually showing how it'll display on the ad. Fast and affordable service, custom packages. So in this instance we're talking about auto detailing and this could be true for basically any service but you know, with auto detailing, people want to know that it's fast and affordable. They also want to know that they can get a free estimate, that we have good experience, that we're experienced and reliable, all that stuff, right? So that's what we've added so far. But let's say we want to add a few more. You can keep adding to this too. Like after you've added the first five, you could add two or three more. And Google will just essentially start testing and figuring out what's the best combination and which ones to use and when to use them. So you can just give it as many as you want. And it'll do its uh, testing to figure out what's going to perform the best. But for the call out extension, you know, it's going to be the reasons why somebody would want to work with you. So, you know, stuff like locally owned and operated. That's common over 20 years of experience that's another good one I think I may have gone over so you can use like 20 plus years of experience stuff like you know what your prospect would want to know if they're like yeah I, I'm gonna hire this auto detailer or this plumbing company or buy this product or what what have you um, what information does the prospect want to know that is going to separate you from everybody else? So you can add what you think is going to be the best fit here. I've given you some good examples to start with. Um, once you're done with that, then you can just click save and that's going to go ahead and save your call out extensions and then they'll look like this. Initially, they won't be enabled. They'll be uh, pending review, most likely. Uh, but once they're enabled, they'll start running on your ads. As your extensions, all of your extensions, including your callout extensions, but we'll just talk about your callout extensions here. When they start running on your ads, it'll start collecting some of this data. You can see we've got some conversions here, uh, some clicks, obviously, a really high conversion rate, like 21% across the board. However, this data is a little confusing because a callout extension is just a bit more information at the the bottom of the description of your ad and it's not clickable if somebody clicks on it it just takes them straight to the landing page or the the website url that you provided for the ad right so 
this information that you're seeing here is actually just correlating when this extension shows up. So when custom packages as an extension shows up, it's, sh it's shown up 104 times on this ad. And of that, it's received, the ad received eight clicks. Not necessarily the extension, but when this extension showed on the ad, the ad received eight clicks. And the ad received three conversions of those eight clicks, which resulted in an $8 cost per conversion, a 37% conversion rate. But that just means that the ad itself is converting at a high rate when this, when this um, call out extension is displaying. So when it comes to optimizing things, first of all, you want to make sure you're looking at plenty of data. So we're only looking at one month. We'd probably want to look at you know, as much data as we possibly can. <laughs> so we can see, you know, uh, basically you want to have like hundreds of click, at least 100 clicks on each of these so you can get a good understanding of how it performs or at least somewhere in the ballpark of that. However, it's just important for you to know that this extension itself didn't receive three conversions and this extension itself didn't receive eight clicks. This extension just showed up on the ads 104 times and of those times it showed up, the ad itself got eight clicks and received three conversions. So I hope that is helpful in understanding how the analytics work as well as setting up your actual call out extensions in Google ads. If there's anything you do have questions about, don't hesitate to reach out. You can just drop your questions in the comment section below and I'll be sure to get back to them there. Look, if you're the type of person that just doesn't even want to deal with Google ads anymore, <laughs> then you can always reach out to me. Uh, my company is Missoula SEO Geek. I'll leave a link to my website down below, but we do manage Google ads for different companies and in different industries and you can come learn about what we do, what makes us unique. You can even read some of the testimonials from some businesses that we've taken from zero to over a million in revenue, like this one here. And really just see that, you know, this is the type of thing that's gonna explode your business growth. So feel free to reach out. You can always give us a call or contact us through our website and look forward to working with you.